All right. Hey, PlayStation 5, we're getting our first look and first reviews are starting to hit the interwebs. And I couldn't be more excited about this. Of course, a few weeks ago, I talked about Sony here, a company I'm hot on because of not only all of the cameras that they produce inside of smartphones. You know, anytime you buy an iPhone, you're getting a Sony camera built in because they build all of the lenses, right? Almost 60% of all smartphones that you're going to buy have a Sony camera in it. So I am bullish on this company. And I think the Sony PlayStation 5 just just uh, scored a huge home <laughs> home run. The early reviews are in. So if you've been catching like MKBHD, Marquez Brownlee, he got uh, his hands on with the new Sony PlayStation 5. And this thing is gorgeous. And we're not allowed to see the gameplay just yet. We're seeing just some unboxings of this and what it actually looks like. And it's actually pretty big. It's a pretty big console. You can put it on its side, stand it upright. It comes with a disk drive. If you get the one that has a disk drive, or you can get the streaming only version, the digital only, which is what I would get. This is going to be one of the most difficult gifts to get for Christmas. I can already, already know that it's going to be super difficult. What's really cool is, Marquez pointed this out, when you zoom in, you look really tight on the controller. It has this like really tiny little texture of like X's and O's and triangles, like the PlayStation um, numerology, I guess, or the symbology. So the controller itself even has that little texture, but it's all really, you wouldn't even notice that um, if you wouldn't zoom in like that. Again, um, it's gorgeous. Here, some of the CPU on this thing has AMD Zen 2 base CPU with eight cores, processing power, GPU, 10.28 teraflops. The GPU architecture has a custom RDNA 2 memory interface, 16 gigabytes of uh, GDDR6 and 256 bit memory bandwidth 448 gigabytes internal storage i always find it weird it comes with 825 gigabytes of internal storage on an ssd drive why don't just make it a terabyte i don't get that just make it a terabyte and the controller i'm excited about this controller by the way so what's interesting in these early unboxings they're not allowed to show any of the gameplay right now um they're just able to show you what the controller and the the set the 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 actual console looks like. It only it ships with an HDMI cable and one controller, one of these dual sense controllers. JF, where were you able to pre-order yours? Look at that. So that's how it stacks up against the uh, the new Xbox and the new Xbox line. But check out so this dual sense controller is pretty sweet. And the way you're like, you can maneuver and you feel like this vibration in a way that you didn't with those other controllers. So um, this is a skill ups channel. He did a review. He actually got some gameplay in Australia, super jelly of him. And that's the dual sense controller right there with this haptic feedback. And it has like an LED light underneath the front of this thing instead of on the back like it used to. It's got a speaker right there in front. You can, it has these, uh, a, a charging, like a little charging dingus in the front that you can put it on this little charging pad. Dual with another controller. But he got a chance to play with this thing, the DualSense haptic feedback, and he says it, it was amazing. Just listen to what he had to say about this. I'm super jealous. I could not believe this, this when I held this in my hand and I started feeling the rumble. Uh, in fact, I think our, like, our reactions probably when we were using it like for the first time, I think it's probably the best thing to show. Mm. There's this demo here that I'm playing on screen where it's actually ticking up and like dropping blocks into the PlayStation control on screen. Mm -hmm. And I can feel like each of those blocks on either side. There was a part in the menu earlier where it was kind of like a light was shining across the menu. And I could feel the rumble on the controller sliding across mm. there. And I was like, this is amazing, okay? I oh, that thing is amazing. So again, the new PlayStation 5 coming out. We don't see the gameplay yet. And even the way that he was being framed in that shot, they can't show the screen. We're not allowed to see what the gameplay looks like. We're not allowed to see it. They don't want to see any of them doing it. So they're, they're still under embargo. All of the reviewers that are getting their hands on these right now, they're all under um, embargo. So they can only show off the actual uh, box itself. <laughs> they can't show the gameplay. 
which is pretty funny. So they can show the console and the cords and the, and you know, they get more bang for their buck. So next week or so when their embargo lifts, we'll get to see some actual gameplay of this thing. Uh, but it's going to be pretty sweet. I'm excited about it because there's a number of different apps that I use, like obviously Netflix and Apple TV plus, by the way, um, is coming to the PlayStation. And so this thing is going to be wicked fast. I can't wait to see how quickly apps load if you're using, you know, if you use it for Netflix or you use it for Apple TV or some other products like that. It's going to be super sweet. See how fast this thing is. Um, so, yeah, if anyone has any idea where I can pre-order one of these things and get my hands on one. Um, it's so funny, me covering technology back in the day, I would have been one of these guys that gets a pre-order or gets one of these units ahead of time to review. Um, but those days have gone as I've gotten a little older. Now, now it's a younger man's game, I guess. So there you go. First look and the reviews are starting to come in for the PlayStation 5. And I'll have links to uh, both MKBHD's video as well as SkillUp's um, channel. So you can take a look more deeply at those videos and go deeper. I, I love Marquez Brownlee. He did a great job showing off just how sexy this thing is. So there you go. PlayStation 5. Will you buy one? Let me know in the chat below if you're going to pick one of these up. Again, my, uh, my son wants one bad, but I don't know. Now if we're going to be able to find one. 